Hi, and welcome to this first attempt at YouTube. Today we're gonna make a busy board in the form of a cube for my son's daycare. Um, I cut some planks that you see behind me out of black MDF, and we're gonna fill it with a whole bunch of fun stuff I found at the do-it-yourself store. So I had some stuff lying around the house that I can use. It's basically some power wire from my house, a couple of tin cans, this weird yellow cleaning thing, two toilet plungers, some inner tubing, clothes pins, washers, padlock, casters, something that helps you draw up blinds, plastic chain, brass chain, a sample piece of fake grass, a light switch, some more locks, a couple of cute buttons shaped like animals, and a big ass tube to make a phone. This is like what you used to fill up a pond. That's pretty much it. And with all that stuff, we're gonna make a busy board for a bunch of toddlers. Since a bunch of kids were gonna use this, I decided to round over all the edges with a router. And it was really cold, so I needed to warm up. I cut out a hole for the flexible hose to fit through to make my phone. And then it was time to add a lot of fun things for the kids. I started with a few locks and screwed them into place. Brass and plastic chains became arms for my crab. I wanted five of the six sides of the box to be playable, so I took them out one by one and added fun things to each side. The crab needed to be able to run on the bottom of the sea, so I cut a little groove where it could move in. Turned a few dowels into drumsticks, which the kids could use to knock on the top of the thing. And to be completely
completely safe, I took out all the screw heads that poked out on the inside of the box. The game on this side was merely some electrical wire and a whole bunch of clothespins. These are actually toilet plungers that I wrapped up with some aluminium tape to give them a cool look. And then it was time for assembly. I kept it as simple as possible, just using some wood glue and some screws on the inside of the box. I added my garden hose and the end caps of the plungers to make a foam. The final step was to use the cut-off dowels to make a few little mannequins with a soldering iron. And then it was time to show it to the kids.